Hi Dhanesh. Hey Ayushi. As you know that CAT examination dates are closer. I still remember my days like how excited I was on that day. So what was your uh, strategy towards the CAT? So my strategy was basically I used to do the lots of mock tests and I used to focus on all the three sections of, for the CAT. But my strongest section was DILR as I like to solve the logical problems and there is something new you have to do. So th uh, that was my thing I used to do. What was your strategy? Uh, I also do, did the same. I gave the lot of mocks uh, till, till the last moment. And also on that examination day, um, uh, my slot was one and so I wake up early in the morning and then on the, on the, uh, in the test, I just, uh, uh, I, I just went to every uh, set like in the equation paper and then just gave a eye look to every, every set and uh, uh, all the possible answers and the uh, MCQs. What was your... Uh, so in the I, I, use, I think that there are three things you should focus upon. The, the first thing is you should uh, first go through this and scan the question paper and select the sets which are most uh, quickly you can solve then attempt those sets and if you think that you can attempt that those sets then you should go for solving those sets. Mm. So this is the basic thing and what are your take on this? And I think I just attempted though DI was my uh, uh, was my strongest point I still went for LR set first because DI is some, somewhat tedious it requires a lot of calculations so I went to the LR sets first I just uh, saw the uh, LR sets and picked up the one which is which I am strongest at like some of the sets which re, which are data driven so I went through those sets and then um, uh, I stuck on stuck on those one set, but still I choose to move into uh, move into another set, which is uh, which I think I will be very poor at, but end up move end up doing better mm -hmm. on that set. So that was my yeah. Uh, same was the thing with me. So mm -hmm. I did the first set and it was quite easy. So I mm -hmm. picked up the right set at the right moment. So mm -hmm. after that I picked up the second set and mm -hmm. that also I uh, quite solved it the second set also. But in the third set I got stuck. Mm -hmm. So I thought that this is quite lean, lengthy set and we have to figure out which sets are lengthy. So you, you skip those sets and mm -hmm. move to the sets which you are comfortable at and which are short in length so you can uh, complete those sets in the time constraint. In fact, in sets, I thought that I won't be able to solve it. And I thought that these sets won't be able to But when I started moving into those sets, um, I just came to know that questions are hidden in questions. Yes, so yes. I just uh, keep... Uh, strolling my uh, uh, feed on uh, this screen yeah. and then I came to know ki kuch kuch questions mein answers and then I picked up those hints and start solving my LR uh, set and um, yeah, I still remember ki last two minutes mein bhi mera ek set mein pura solve kiya tha. so it's a very good experience uh, to the set yeah. and uh, so I would say that uh, cat exams are coming close and we should fo the cat aspirant should focus on the mock tests and give the previous year papers because mm -hmm. we see that the patterns are the same. The question patterns come in the CAT papers are quite same. So giving the previous year paper is quite a strategy a candidate must follow. Uh, and I can also I also want to add that just uh, set elimination is very uh, very necessary. And also when you get, uh, get stuck into any kind of set, just move into it. Just move with it. Just uh, uh, just drop that set and just move with it. And also, uh, if you are good at DI, still remember that LR is little easy to solve because DI is the tedious. You require a lot of calculations. So just move with the LR set, and uh, yes, that's all my side. So all the best for the CAT exam.